What's up guys? Welcome to another video. I have another monitor we are looking at today. This is the Asus ROG Swift PG279QM, a 27 inch uh, WQHD monitor, 2560 by 1440, 240 hertz, fast IPS, one millisecond response time, and a built in G Sync processor. It also has Asus Aura Sync, whatever that is. DVI, um, HDMI, you know, HDR 400, VESA certified. Um, the thing is, I have to get this out of the way now. I bought a um, used one because brand new, these monitors brand new are over eight, over a thousand dollars right now, and I paid like I think six fifty for this, you know, used. So in it's like these used products from B and H, they're pretty good about checking them over and making sure you're gonna get a good product. So I have 14% battery left, so let's go ahead and open this up. Be careful with knives, children. We have a new setup here we're using here at the studio. Yeah, this is the studio now. We have this blanket behind me. Um, I do this first time. Apparently not. These darn boxes. Be careful with knives, children. Always point the knife away from you. Always point the knife away from you. I thought about doing this live, too. Um, because this is like... It's kind of, I like this system right here. Like, it doesn't work too great. Um, I'm, I'm a small, I'm a short person, so like, how am I gonna get, how am I gonna get in here? Like, I'm gonna have to do this. Careful when you do this, people. Let me do this. And then, what I do here is I'm gonna pull this out from the bottom. We don't need this box no more. Put this on the side. Inside here, there is. Color calibration testing report. Wow, these are factory pre calibrated for unmatched color accuracy. So, uh, this is this is pretty much report says here that the guys who made this monitor are taking their time to make sure this is factory calibrated for the best color accuracy. And they got stickers. I always like stickers. Stickers are great. I'm going to put those off to the side there in the box. Um, take the top piece off right here. And then Oh boy, this is gonna be a good monitor. Ugh, that's the monitor itself. So we'll take that out in a second. Um, just a little idea about the monitor arm on the back. We're taking it off because we don't need it. So once we get that monitor arm off, then, like all the weight will be gone pretty much. Don't fall, don't fall. On the bottom, on the bottom of here, more parts of the monitor stand which we will not, which we will, which we will not be using because it's monitor mount. There's unnecessary. I have a wall mount for this. No, actually I have a mount that goes on the on this desk. I had to take my desk actually out from the wall and we're using it right now for this review or unboxing. Um and this little plastic thing that comes right out um that just fell apart. Um this is like the, the clip you put on the back of the monitor to hide your cable, so I lost my last one so we'll keep that. Um, what else do they have in here for cables? You get all the basics, you know, you get the power cable. We're not really interested in what's in this box. You get your power brick. Wow, that's a weird looking power brick. Um, manuals, manuals. Um, they send you a DVI and a, um, where's that kind of? Nope, DVI and HDMI cables here. So, yeah, you're, and then you one more or something. Um, I think this is, what is this? Yep, this is because there's, on the back of the monitor, there's USB ports you can use. So they give you this to plug into the monitor to use those USB ports. So let's go ahead and take this thing uh, out of this thing. Oh, static crystal. Oh, that's not good. Make sure you do static clang. No, don't do that, guys. That's a bad idea. That, that's, I just felt static clang in there. That's not good. Um, so here's this. This monitor arm is going to be coming off because I don't need it. It's just going to add it adds more weight that I don't need. Oh, let's take this off. Should be a beautiful display. Um, one of the best ones they make. This is like something everyone uses. You know, I, I had I couldn't buy a new a new one because they were out of stock. So you got this. Um, all the weight seems to be in the monitor arm, which is coming off. So this should mount pretty easily. Um, so yeah, this is going to be a decent gaming this setup. We're going to hook this up and check it out. Um, I'll let you guys know how you know, it goes out. This should be a good monitor. And yeah, so yeah, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, do all that kind of cool stuff, and make sure you got your notifications turned on. Because YouTube doesn't send them out all the time, you know. Whatever, YouTube's weird, but yeah. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.